Hi, I'm Jordan McCool, and it's time to ask the attorney your question. I'm here with attorney Kim Sudnick from Heyman Law Firm. Hi, Kim. Thanks so much for joining us. Hi, Jordan. Great to be here. Okay, so Jane wrote in and said, ask the attorney, I was badly injured in an accident last month when a car made a left-hand turn in front of me, totaling my car and breaking my ankle, which required surgery. I just learned that the other driver has only $20,000 in insurance. Is this legal? And also, what am I going to do as I have been out of work since the accident and my medical bills are over $50,000? Well, that's an excellent question that Jane has here. And you know, I've been practicing law for 25 years in Massachusetts, and so many times we have minimum policies. Yes, Jane, I'm sorry to answer your question. It is legal to have only 20,000 of liability coverage. What does that mean? That means the insurance company does not have to pay over that $20,000 limit, no matter what your medical bills are. But there could be some other avenues of recovery. And would it change if that person was for, say, let's they worked for Uber or they delivered pizzas for Domino's or, you know, Great they point. drove for Lyft? How would that change things? Great point, Jordan. Yes. So if the driver is working for Uber or Lyft, you have now two potential defendants and two in- different insurance policies. And most companies like Uber and Lyft may have high coverage. And Domino's, if you're working for Domino's delivering a pizza or you're delivering an auto part and you cause an accident, your employer is going to be liable. Also, if you send somebody on an errand for you, like to run an errand and you're exercising significant control over them, then you too may be liable for the injuries they cause when there is an at-fault driver. There's also something called underinsurance coverage. Underinsurance coverage kicks in when the at-fault driver doesn't have enough insurance to pay your damage. Underinsurance is something you buy for your family. So if you're married, have kids, own a home, you want to consider getting under insurance coverage to get that extra protection for your family. Well, it sounds like Jane has a lot of options. Thanks so much for all of that advice. And to ask the attorney your question, you can either call 1-800-HAYMAN or you can email attorney at haymanlaw.com.